Here are some interesting facts about the honeybee. The honeybee is found throughout the world in almost every country. They have been around for more than 30 million years. There is approximately 20,000 different types of bee found in the world, seven of which are recognized as species of honeybee. There are also another 34 subspecies of the honeybee. The honeybees build and live in hives. A hive is run by the female queen bee. There is only one queen per hive. The queen is the only sexually active female in the hive, and she can lay up to 2,500 eggs per day. A group of bees that live together in a hive are called a colony. A colony of bees can contain between 20,000 and 80,000 bees. Each colony has a unique odour, so that each bee can recognise their home. Bees have an amazing sense of smell. In addition to the queen bee, there are another two types of bee that live in the hive. There are both workers and drones. Worker bees are females. They clean the hive, collect pollen and nectar to feed the colony, and take care of the offspring. The drones are male. Their only job is to mate with the queen. The queen's only job is to lay eggs. Workers and drones live for around six weeks, whereas a queen lives an average of one to three years, and sometimes up to five years. A bee's wings move 190 times a second. That's 11,400 times every minute. They can fly as fast as 15 miles per hour. Worker bees, who are all female, are the only bees that will sting. They only sting in self-defense, and they will die immediately after they sting. The bee's brain is oval in shape, and is only about the size of a sesame seed, yet they have a remarkable capacity to learn and remember things, and they are able to make complex calculations with distance and traveling. They are also able to communicate with each other by using movement. They have two separate stomachs, one for food and one for nectar. They survive in the winter time by huddling together for warmth, and eating honey they have stored up throughout the year. Worker bees spend large amounts of time collecting pollen. Not only is pollen a food source, but some pollen is dropped in flight, resulting in cross-pollination. As a result, a third of all plants that we eat are pollinated by honeybees. So bees massively impact the production of our food supply. Without them, over a hundred plants across the world would cease to exist. Thank you very much for listening. For more videos about wildlife, please subscribe.